watch movements come in various shapes. Each specific watch movement is known as a caliber. Mechanical watch movements are manual or automatic. Manual or hand winding as it's also known requires the wearer to turn the crown periodically in order to wind the mainspring. The majority of projects that I create are mostly comprised of mechanical movements. These are easy to assemble, reliable, and a variety of calibers are easy to source, such as the 6497 or the popular Russian Molynesia movement. Both originated from pocket watch designs which were later converted to wristwatches. Automatic or self-winding. This category comprises what most mechanical watches on the market today are. The mainspring is automatically wound by the natural motions of the wearer while it is on the wrist, therefore eliminating the need for manual wind. Automatic movements work largely in the same way that manual movements do, with the addition of a metal weight called a rotor. The rotor is connected to the movement and it can rotate freely with each movement on the wrist. The rotor spins, transferring energy and winding the mainspring. Quartz movements are very accurate and require minimal maintenance aside from battery replacements. They come in a variety of sizes and are cheap to produce. Although they aren't as desirable to most watch enthusiasts because they lack the technical craftsmanship and engineering of mechanical movements. All of this is meant to keep track of one important thing, time.